Hello everyone and welcome to I Know You Know, your one stop knowledge sharing platform for all things careers, life after high school, as well as opportunities that are available to you. Thank you so, so much for tuning into this video. As you saw by the title, this is another bursary o'clock and this is for the legal eagles. So I'll be covering all the bursaries that are available for people that are studying degrees within the legal department. And what I'll do is there are actually so many that I am going to break this up into a couple of sessions. So this is part one, enjoy. This video is in partnership with ZA Bursaries. And as you will see, all the links to the bursaries that I will be mentioning will be in the description box below. What I'll do is I will mention the name of the bursary as well as a fact or two about it, just so that you can get an idea of who it covers, etc. And what you can then do is just follow the link of the bursary you're interested in and go to the ZA bursary platform to look at the rest of the information about that specific bursary. There you'll be able to find things like eligibility details, application details, and any other details that are important for someone who would be applying for the bursary. Without any further ado, let's get into it. You will realize that some bursaries closing dates have passed and some are in previous years. The reason I've kept these bursaries on this list is in case they do open them again or in case they are open again, that you will know about the bursaries and you can go onto their site and keep an eye on them so that you don't miss out on the opportunity. So don't be frustrated if you find that some of the bursaries have been closed. This is for future purposes and for when they do open them. The first one is the Alan Gray Obus Foundation Bursary. Unfortunately, this is closed. It closed on the 30th of April. I have filmed a video about the Alan Gray Obus Foundation. It's quite detailed and talks about what the fellowship program is all about. So I will link that in the description box below in case you are interested in watching that video. The next is the Legal Practitioners Fidelity Fund Bursaries. This is available for postgraduates as well as undergraduate graduates that are studying law. The closing date for this is 15th of August 2021. Next is Bowman's Bursaries. This covers LLB, BCom Law, as well as BA Law. The closing date for this is 20 September 2020. So if it is open, chances are it will most probably have the same closing date this year as well. So keep an eye on that. The fourth one is the Bridgestone Bursary. This is for students in Port Elizabeth or Quebec. Quebec. I hope I said it right. Um, this is for students that are in PE who are studying LLB, BCom Law, as well as BA Law. And the closing date was, unfortunately, the 12th of April, 2021. Number five, Bushbuck Ridge Local Municipality Bursary. This is for residents of Bushbuck Ridge, as you might expect. And the closing date was the 29th of January, 2021. So look out for it if you're trying to apply in the upcoming years. The next one is C and A Friedlander Bursary. This covers tuition. And for the duration of your studies, you will get to do holiday programs with them, which include vacation work, etc. So that's quite great. And when you are done, when you've graduated, you get to do articles with them as well. The closing date is 1st September 2020. Number seven is the Canon Collins and the University of London Scholarship for Distance Learning. This is for postgraduate certificates or diplomas, as well as LLM, so Masters in Law. And it covers distance learning specifically at the University of London. You need to be a national or a refugee in one of these countries, South Africa, Zambia, Malawi, or Congo. And you need to be residing in one of those as well. Closing date is the 7th of June, 2021, five o'clock GMT. The next one is the Canon Collins Trust Jewel Jove Scholarship. This is available for third year LLB students who are studying at the University of Western Cape and the University of Forte. Closing date is 15 September 2019. I'm not sure if it's been renewed, but you can definitely check that out. The next one is the Canon Collins Trust Lee Day Scholarship. It's for second and third year LLB students who are studying the University of Western Cape as well as the University of Forte. 
the closing date for this is also 15th September 2019. The 10th one and last for this video is the Canon Collins Sol Blackie Scholarship. This is specifically for postgraduate, so covering masters as well as PhD. And during the for the duration of your studies, you will be expected to attend conferences and small events throughout the year. The closing date for this is 10th of August 2020. There you have it. Those are 10 different bursaries that you can apply for if you want to study law. I will be filming a part two, so stay tuned for that. All the best with everyone who will be applying and let us know if you come all right in the comment section below. Thank you so, so much for tuning in. Goodbye.